वेलकम बैक ऑन इन्फो फोर ट्रिपली एंड यू आर वाचिंग अ सीरीज ऑन बेसिक्स ऑफ मेटलेब सिम लिंक दिस इज थर्टी थर्ड वीडियो ऑफ दिस सीरीज इन विच वी विल लर्न टू जनरेट सिंगल फेस ट्रिपल सिग्नल यूजिंग मेटलेब सिम लिंक एंड यू आर विद परमजीत सिंह जामवाल first of all we will discuss what is trapezoidal signal this is a trapezoidal signal which is initially a having a length they after it is having constant value they after it is having a, a negative ramp then a negative constant value and then again increasing ramp and this trapezoidal signal can be obtained from a triangular signal and this triangular signal is varying from 0 to 1 while it is clipped after 0.5 to obtain posterior cycle of this trapezoidal signal why it is clipped at minus 0.5 to obtain its negative cycle of trapezoidal signal so now moving towards the practical session on matlab in this video we will continue the simulation we have created in 9th video of this series so first of all open that simulation and save this simulation with different name now to generate the triangular wave as required first of all update the repeating sequence setting so it should be 0 0.01 2 and in between it should be 0.005 0.015 and here it should be initially 0 and after after it should be 1 then 0 then minus 1 and then 0 so now close it by clicking on okay button now to saturate the output of this triangular wave we required a saturation block so go to simlink library browser and go to disk continuities and here our saturation block so drag this block into your simulation file remove this block from here and connect this saturation block here now click on this block to check its setting upper limit is 0.5 and lower limit is minus 0.5 and it is required so we no need to update it now click on score button and go to setting and update its sample time to 10 microsecond and now change simulation stop time to 0.1 and now run this simulation and here our second output is not clear so click on scale x and y axis now you can see that we have obtained a triangular wave having amplitude 0 to 1 and 0 to minus 1 while trapezoidal wave from having amplitude 0 to 0.5 0 and minus 0.5 so in this way we have obtained our trapezoidal signal from triangular signal so this is sufficient for today i am thankful to mr harsh tyagi for his appreciating words if this video is useful to you then like and share it if you have any query or suggestions then let me know through your comments if you want to get a notification about our upcoming videos then subscribe our channel and click on bell icon thank you for being with us